I'm Aisha Morris, and today with wrist work, I have a special guest. Hi, I'm Joy, and I'm one of Miss Morris's students. So we have Joy today, and we're going to make stuffed cabbage rolls. I chose to use purple cabbage because it's full of color. So the first thing that I did was I put it in boiling water. And let's see if I can get this out. You wanna make sure that you cut the stem off and wash your cabbage. You always wanna wash your lettuce very well, okay? And then I put it in the pot facing down so that the water can kind of get inside of the leaves. So we're just going to strip it off and get a couple of leaves off. So the leaves are already cooked and really tender. You can use green cabbage as well, but I just chose purple today. If you want to get a bright purple color, you can always put it in an ice bath. An ice bath is just water and equal parts water, equal parts ice. And you kind of want to shock it a little bit. So if you have time, you can do that. But you just want to do this for about five minutes in a pot so that it can get really tender. All right. And we have some ground turkey. We have some carrots. And I cooked the ground turkey in scallion. Uh, I used one onion, one green onion, and I used about a fourth inch of ginger, fresh ginger, like this. This, a lot goes a long way, so like, you know, be really careful with that. And now we have carrots. And I cooked this in olive oil. So we're gonna take one. You can go ahead and grab some turkey. Get it all the way into the center of the leaf and a little bit of carrots. Pretty good. You wanna push it all the way down to the bottom like you're rolling a burrito, okay? And you just want to roll like this. Roll it tight. You wanna tuck in the ends and then you stick it in your pan. Once you're done rolling your cabbage rolls, you can always add uh, tomato paste over the top with a little bit of olive oil and it gives it a great, great texture. 